regardless of why you're leaving your job, crafting a well-written resignation letter is essential. It not only helps you leave on a positive note, but also maintains professional relationships that can benefit you in the future. Subscribe to CV Maker today so you don't miss out on any of our valuable career advice. So what exactly is a resignation letter? Well, it's more than just a piece of paper or email. It's a formal document that you write to your employer when you've decided to leave your job. While it may feel ceremonial, this document serves as an official record of your departure. First things first, let's talk about the key components of a resignation letter. It's not just about saying, I quit and signing your name. There is a little more to it than that especially if you want to leave on a positive note. You should start with a polite greeting, followed by a clear statement of your intention to resign and your last working day. Skip the small talk and ask about their weekend and just get straight to the point. Consider the following before starting your resignation letter. Addressing your manager by name makes your writing more personalized and shows respect. Including the current date provides a reference point for the letter. Including your personal details ensures your employer can easily reach you if needed. Explicitly state you are resigning to clarify that this is a formal notice. Specify the end date that is in line with your contractual notice period. Thank your employer for expressing gratitude for the provided opportunities. A signature gives a professional touch to your letter. Step 1. Include the date and notice period. Clearly stating your resignation date and notice period is essential. If you're unsure what your notice period is, check your employment contract or employee handbook. For example, I am writing to formally resign from my position as care assistant at Home Care Alliance. My last working day will be March 31st, 2024, providing the standard notice period. Step two, show gratitude for the opportunity. It's important to express gratitude for the opportunities you've had at the company and offer to assist with the transition process. Be sincere and highlight any positive experience or a project you particularly enjoyed working on. For example, I want to take this opportunity to express my deepest gratitude for the experiences and opportunities I have had during my time in this role. It has been an honour to work alongside such talented individuals and contribute to the launch of our innovative social media campaign, Project Boost. If you're struggling to elaborate further on this section, for one reason or another, a simple, I would like to thank you and the team for all the opportunities during my time working here, is sufficient and still maintains a positive tone. Step three, assist with the transition period. Lastly, express your willingness to assist in the transition process by offering to train your replacement or document processes. This gesture demonstrates professionalism and a commitment to ensuring that your departure does not disrupt the workflow of the company. For example, I am committed to ensuring a smooth transition and am available to assist in training my replacement as a customer service assistant during this period ensuring they are equipped with the necessary skills and knowledge to excel in the role. If you are looking for something more simple, consider signing off your letter with the following, I wish you all the best. If I can be of assistance during this transition, please let me know. The key to a successful resignation letter is to keep it concise, respectful and professional.